Hey dudes, it's me, sipping on a tamarind Haritas. So today, I've decided to unbox a Shutterfly package of photos from the first half of the um, 100 day photo challenge thing that I've been doing. I stopped really giving video updates on that because I stopped filming <laughs> video updates on that. So anyway, I haven't opened it. It's been a while since I received it. Um, I've signed up for their like emails or maybe that's just automatic and pretty frequently they'll send little sales that are like, hey, you can get free prints but then you also have to pay for shipping. So I think it's like $12 or something for shipping which is kind of a lot, especially since they still just shove this in our mailbox. Um, even though it's not supposed to be bent. I really wanted to get a mix of the 4x4 kind of Instagram style photos because they're kind of cute having like a border and everything and uh, some of the 4x6s but the way that the deal was like arranged <laughs> You could either get 4x4 or 4x6, not both, so I decided to get 4x6s because that's like a standard photo size that I have all of my other photos in. Oh, this actually does have some other prints in it too because I uh, just wanted to get kind of as much as I could for the same cost. This picture from Whole Foods, this is uh, just when we were looking for beer before going to Jeopardy night, took a picture of the ceiling. This one is a photo from going to In-N-Out. This is the drive-through at nighttime. Um, here's just a leaf from a parking lot of the library near where I live. This one's a ladybug on some lavender, and then this is a fence that's next to it. I'm like taking pictures of flowers or something close to it and then there's a bug and I'm like oh hell yeah a subject to focus on. This was a picture taken while driving on like kind of a back road. That's why the foreground's a little bit like blurrier than you'd expect. This is the cutest fucking cloud and just like a beautiful gradient in the sky and these are some roofs. This is having a camera pointing straight upwards at some trees while I was at the park. Oh god, that went in my nose. <sighs> Alright. <laughs> Here's a, a rag with some paint on it that was on the ground. I think we were walking to like the corner store or something when I took this picture. As kind of a joke. <laughs> because it was artsy. I saw this in a store window. I thought it looks pretty cool. This is in a shop window. I really like mannequins with like insects and stuff. It's kind of once you start looking for things, you'll find them. So here's a spider web. It's pretty cool looking. Here's a an artichoke. We went to the grocery store and I brought my camera because I needed to take a picture for that day. And I took some pictures of some like foil um, like bakeware like this. Then I have a bunch of pictures from when we went to the beach that I really like. Like this one. It was a really, the weather was really great when we went. Oh hey there's a bird in this one. Look at that. There's a bird up here. It's pretty cute. It's got these uh, um, thistle. These old thistle things. Ha! <laughs> thistle things. Yeah, like this one's really cute. I really like these. They're really pretty. I've found that I really like kind of like the homey vibes, <laughs> I guess, type pictures. Like of white picket fences and like cute little houses, cute little gardens, like that kind of thing. I have some roses with a fence. And then these are some older photos from when I went to the forest. So some ferns, this redwood, some moss, and then I have some even older pictures that are some in the similar vein to what I would take now. They're just from winter. Got a Christmas light, 
This I love. I love this. I just love gardens and houses. It's so cute. I've taken so many pictures of just this. <laughs> I love the way it looks. This is it's just such a warm picture from um, a while ago. This is from November last year. These are all from November, so they're a lot more like fall. Like this one around October. I love this picture of like an office, like abandoned office space with like the reflection of these trees. So it almost seems like like nature is encroaching onto this like man-made space. The remnants of a fire. So I think these were from a controlled burn. So that's this first envelope. So this covers some of the older photos um, from before the 100 day photo project plus some of the photos that I didn't pick and didn't edit from that first batch. All right, well, I've been talking for too long and I want the AC back on, so <laughs> I will uh, continue this later. <laughs> okay, bye.